Well, it's snack time. Hey, Jonah, somebody selling hats here tonight? Yeah, selling hats, yeah. There's somebody selling hats out there. Like, like this? I like this. What did you bring for snack, John? I, I brought some chocolate-covered anchovy-flavored gummy bears. Now, anybody who wants to share, we just get grab John at snack time and go share with us. Uh, Toby, what did you bring? Pippin and I. <coughs> yeah, it's Pippin, me. Pippin, Pippin, yeah, I, I, I forgot. I, I completely forgot. Well, and I'm going to share my snack, snack with him. Uh, we brought a watermelon that is chilling in that refrigerator Chill there, marked Coca Cola in the back. So we'll bring it out. And I think it should be for the dancers who are dancing so strenuously here. Well, dancers get first bid on the That's side. right. We'll chop that thing open. You guys can have some. Oh, flavored water. Steve, what did you bring from snack? Well, my good friend, Mr. G, gave me these cookies that he made by himself. All right. Without even an oven. Mr. T's on a carrot kick lately. He got, him from, he got the recipe from Mr. Coffee. And Steve will share his snack. Oh, Danny? I brought popcorn. This this snack has a lot of history. Let's not forget, it's probably one of the most dignified snacks known on this continent. Um, when the Washizu first set uh, foot on this continent after coming over from Europe, you know, the Washizu meaning foreigners, um, they were uh, presented with popcorn on the uh, first uh, Indian Day of Mourning, or rather Thanksgiving dinner that we celebrate. And anyway, here it is. It's popcorn, and we would like to share it with everyone. Now, Danny brought a very savored snack. What'd you bring, Barry? I brought a very profane <laughs> snack. I brought a, um, a box of shit from a multinational corporation. <laughs> Snack time! <laughs>